Hello, everyone. So I see that this is a recent problem. You cannot find classic activities in your UiPath Studio. And so I built, I opened this project and I named it, I have no classic, classic activities. Uh, it's a pretty simple fix. You go to manage packages and um, before we do that, let me navigate from project to here just to show that the problem we're trying to deal with is that uh, when you click this filter drop down, you don't find classic activities. Okay, so back to project or rather back to manage packages. So the way the way I like to look at this is this in the older UI path, you needed to have all these uh, packages. This was the default. Uh, I'm not sure why, but they've changed it. But nowadays you have only um, one on that project. You see just system activities, whereas before you used to have all these. So I would suggest that uh, if you put all these dependencies back, then you'll find what you're looking for, right? So manage packages. And what was the first one we have here? We have Excel.activities. So very quickly, just install all of those. Okay, so you got to spell it properly, right? Dot Excel, dot activities. Oh, yeah. I'm sorry. You have to click all packages first. I uh, forgot to say that. So just do that. Install. I usually like to do like lowest applicable version so that I'm not stymied by any, you know, maybe the latest updates are not good at something. I'll be able to use something prior. Um, so basically install them these missing uh, packages. Uh, I'm going to do one or two. And I imagine the UI automation activities is the one that has the classic. But I find that, you know, having all of them is typically always useful, right? So take a note of this image because I don't want this video to be too long. I'm going to just reinstall all of them. As you can see, it takes a while for each one to load. So I'm going to pause the video so that it doesn't get exceptionally long. Um, as you can see, when we're done with the first one, we have two activities here, not just system activities like when we started, right? So I'm going to go ahead and do the second one. I think you make sure you're clicked on all packages now. That's important. And then you go to, where's my image? Uh, we want mail.activities. So UI path. Oh, jeez. Path. Dot mail dot activities so do the same thing install like I said I prefer the best applicable version and then I say save it takes a while to update all right so that's done as you can see towards my left there is there are three of them now so we're going to move on to testing activities uh, and similarly you open manage packages make sure that Testing again, you've got to be clicked on all packages. Uh, so I'm going to do the rest of the couple version and install, and then save. So that did take long. Uh, the last one, I think, is the one that probably has what you're looking for. So you have part UI automation. So, Click on all packages, UI path, UI automation, activities, right? So install, first version, save. Okay. So that one is done. It took a while, but as you can see, I have one, two, three, four, five, similar to what. Um, so this is what they used to give us by default for not sure why they changed it like i said so if you go to activities now and you click on the drop down you find classic there so i'm kind of hopeful that this was uh, enough to solve your problem if you have this problem remember it's a pretty simple fix you go to manage packages make sure you're, you're clicked on all packages and make sure that you install all these packages if you don't already have them 
right? And you have done that successfully, such as I said in this video, you will find your classic once you click on the activities panel and this filter button. So all the best. Follow my channel. I've got lots of simple, simple videos to help you, especially if you're a beginner or someone who's non-IT um, person who's dabbling into automation. Have a nice day ahead. Bye.